Hi guys, welcome to Mary's Backyard Garden. Today, the weather in Buffalo is perfect. We have clear blue sky, as you can see. I mean, it's really beautiful. So, it's early in the morning and I'm here hanging out with my plants. Um, plus, I actually have time this week because I'm still on um, spring break. We got to go to work, go back to work next week, but right now I'm enjoying every minute of it. So today I'm actually excited to share with you um, and show you around my berry patch over here. The raspberries are ready to harvest. As you can see, a lot of them are ripe. I'll show you. The dark ones are the ones that you should pick. Leave the just leave the red ones because those are not quite ripe yet. But I mean, I have a lot. And every summer I actually get this much. It never fails. I have a lot, it's all the way down there, it's wrapped around my garden. This is actually just for my um, berry, berry patch. I call this my mini berry orchard. So look at this. I mean, it's a lot of them. So you guys are probably wondering how I got to have my raspberry patch in my garden. Well, it was probably like um, 15 years ago when I um, planted just three little, three little raspberry plants that I bought them, I bought from uh, the nursery. And then every year they sprout and then I would transplant them. And I spread them out and then after that, years after years, year after year, they actually spread out like this. So now I have a lot of raspberries and they're actually easy to maintain. These are hardy plants, so you don't need that much um, weeding. And they're actually kind of tall too. So once you, once I usually just plant them, when I planted them, I don't, you know, I only probably um, weed them once a year, like uh, in the middle of spring. So, if anybody is interested having their own berries in the yard, I think it's a beautiful thing because you don't have to go into the farm, to the farm to pick some berries. Plus, you plant it yourself so you know it's organic and fresh. I mean organic and, yeah. Because I never put any fertilizer, it's just God and sunshine. So after these, um, berries are done giving me fruits because probably I, like in the middle of um, July they'll be done fruiting so the next one that I'm going to harvest will be these um, blackberries I also have blackberries I have here in the right here in the middle it has a lot of fruits too. I'll show you around. I mean, there's a lot of fruits. Let me go around so you can see. It's nice and sunny. 
see this? It's just a lot of fruit. I mean, so many. And uh, the blackberries are, the canes are tall. So what I did was I, I put, um, I built like, a, I put like four steel poles. And then I tied up a uh, um, cable, big cable wires to support the canes. And, that's, and then I put them right up. So that's how they are. Otherwise, you don't want them, you know, just laying down the ground. You probably won't get any fruit. They got to be up. So, I mean, that's a lot of berries. When they're, like I said, when they're all ripe, I cannot even keep up with them. But I share with my friends. And also, sometimes I make some um, jellies. And also, well, the birds also help me eat them. They usually, they are usually, they, I usually have a lot of birds around my garden. And also, I have one more thing to show you. This one is not a berry, but I also planted um, a couple of kiwi. I never knew that it can, kiwi can actually grow in a, can thrive in a, um, in a climate where there is winter. I didn't know they can thrive in the in snow, but these are the so-called. Oh, I'll show you. What's the name? I'll show you. Oh, these are the so-called. See that? I did not even take out the tag. I bought them last year. It's called the September Sun Hardy Kiwi. And so they're supposed to withstand the snow, the winter. So it actually, it had a lot, it had, I saw a lot of bloom last time, but I think it only gave me like a few, few fruits. I'll show you, I have some. I saw some developing like, like this here. See that? There. That is my, that is a kiwi, little kiwi, and another one over there, right there, and here too. Oh, I have a couple here, like that, and then right there. Wow. And then more over there. I see one over there. Oh, I actually have like six. They gave me six kiwis. Yay. Wow, I'm gonna be excited. But I actually have to uh, make um, support for this one too. I need to make, um, I think four poles also and make it and now uh, put the vines up there because they're, they're, they, 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 they do climb. See these vines here? They twirl and swirl, so. Okay, so I'm going to pick some berries now. And um, thank you for watching my video. If you enjoyed my video, um, please click and subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye.